John Spartan. Welcome. Now, in honor of your arrival and your protection of the sanctity of human life, namely my own, <laughs> I would like to invite you to join me to dinner tonight. The both of you. Please, I insist. I would like you to accompany me to Taco Bell. Look forward to it. Thank you. Taco Bell? Yes. So let me get this right. Spacely Sprockets here, who's now the man in charge, the mayor of Gov, who wants to take me to dinner at Taco Bell, the Lord knows I wouldn't mind a burrito, is also one of the guys who built the goddamn cryo John Spartan, you are fined 100 for Thanks. violation. Thanks. Dr. Cocteau is the most important man in San Angeles. He practically created our whole way of life, savage. Yeah? Well, he can have it. Now, Phoenix could be anywhere, but not being coded could hurt him and limit his options. That is correct. Money is outmoded. All transactions are through codes. All right, so you can't buy food or a place to stay for the night. And it'd be a waste of time to mug somebody. <laughs> Unless he rips off someone's hand. Let's hope he doesn't figure that one out. But with all officers already patrolling in a citywide crisis net, it should be just a matter of TikToks before we act. More importantly, we already have a backup plan. We can just wait for another code to go red. And when Phoenix performs another murder-death kill, we'll know exactly where to pounce. Great plan. Thank you. He likes your plan, Chief. I've been an enthusiast of your escapades for quite some time now. I have, in fact, perused some newsreels from the Schwarzenegger Library, and that time that you took that car... Hold it. The Schwarzenegger Library? Yes, the Schwarzenegger Presidential Library. Wasn't he an actor when Stop. you... Stop. He was president? Yes. Even though he was not born in this country, his popularity at the time caused the 61st Amendment, which states that... I don't want to know. President. 